Also, can I just say how festive am I with my trees behind me? I have Christmas trees on my bed. They don't actually stay here, but just for this video. And also, I am totally, can you guys see? Let me stand up. Mary AF. Um, I got this shirt from Thread Tank. Um, this isn't sponsored by them, but I, I'm pretty sure I have a code for you guys. It's in my email. Um, so if you guys want this, this top, because y'all are Mary AF, right? Just like me. I hope so. <laughs> hey guys, and welcome back to my channel. Today I am bringing you some kids gift and stocking stuffer ideas for Christmas. Um, first I want to say that it is very gloomy, very cold, but very snowy outside. So it's gloomy. So I apologize for the, the artificial lighting that you're seeing right now. Um, got to work with what I got, but you know, got to get the video out at a decent time so you guys have plenty of time to go shopping. I'm just gonna go ahead and kind of jump on into it. Um, if you are new to my channel, I have two children. I have my daughter who is eight and I have a son who is three. So they are very, there's a vast like array of things. There's a good spectrum of toys and gifts for the age groups but also they like a lot of the same things because my son really likes to kind of like copy his big sister so they do have a lot of the same things, but I'm just gonna go ahead and get started. The stores that I went to for my kids gifts are Five Below, Target, Walmart, and Amazon. Um, I am pretty much done Christmas shopping. The kids are done for sure. Um, but the first things that we got them, which is kind of their big gift for the year, and something I wanted to say first is, um, because they're on sale right now, is we got them both a Kindle Fire. My husband picked these up on Amazon, with, I believe, for, did he say they were $59.99 or $69.99? Either one. That's an amazing deal. A piece, by the way. Not total. A piece. Um, an amazing deal on Amazon right now. Definitely check them out. I will leave a link down below. And by the way, this video is not sponsored by anything. All of the opinions are of my own. Um, and all of these things that I am showing you, we purchased with our own money. So, Kindle Fires really great so they can get the hell off of our phones and use their own things um and i agree i like that it's the kids edition it comes with a bumper and it comes preloaded with some stuff i'm really hoping that we can get the disney plus app on here because that would be really awesome but we're going to preload them with music and some games charge them up and then that way christmas morning when they open them they'll already be ready but we like the kindle fires because they come with the thick bumper really good deal um, the next thing that I got, this is a joint gift for both of them. I got this for $5, okay? And if you guys aren't familiar with the Five Below store, it's amazing. It is like the Target for kids. It has everything that a kid could want in that store, and it's all under $5. It's like an upscale Dollar General, but more geared towards kid stuff they don't sell like cleaning products or anything the speak out game I got this for five dollars at the five below store um I got it for both the kids my son who's three he's not really gonna I mean he's gonna try and play I don't even know if the mouthpieces will fit him but really it's just for my daughter my husband and I I think this is gonna be hilarious we like to have family game nights um and it's just it's just gonna be really funny so five dollars at the local at your five below store this next item I got from Amazon and I believe it was $29.99 or it was on sale for $19.99 or $24.99 something. Uh, sorry, I'm all over the place with prices, but I will leave everything down below for pricing and I will leave links to absolutely everything so you can get the same thing. Um, I got my son a play doctor kit. My son loves to play doctor and he likes to we call his name's Atticus and you know we have to call him Dr. Atticus and he comes and he checks our head and he gives us band-aids and I figure what better than a play doctor set for him um he loves pretend play he loves dressing up in our playroom we have an entire bin dedicated to costumes because he just loves to dress up so this was really a good deal it was on sale right now on Amazon but this doctor kit and they even have one more geared towards girls um they have gender gender different gender so this one's red and um, green and blue and the other one I think was like pink and purple and something else I don't know but so this is for my three-year-old so next for my three-year-old is his own set of headphones these were five dollars at the five below store they are just the Hulk um, like basic Marvel headphones I thought they were 
really cute and just really appropriate for his age. Um, got him for his tablet. Now my daughter is getting some headphones as well, but um, those are coming from grandma. The gift that I got my son is also from the Five Below store. This was also $5 and I got him a remote control monster truck. He loves, loves monster trucks. So I figure a really good gift for five bucks. It comes with a remote. Oh, you can't see. There we go. I thought this was just kind of a really cool looking truck and very simple. They had several different colors, different styles, um, but for five bucks, you really can't go wrong. Now, I don't know if it's going to work that well because it was only five dollars. So sometimes, you know, that is the only bad thing about the five below stores. I mean, it's lower quality, but um, but some stuff is really amazing. So I don't, I don't know. They have the best old school t-shirts at the five below store. I got me a Rocco's Modern Life t-shirt and they have all the vintage cartoons like from when I was a kid, you know, like Hey Arnold, Rugrats, um, Ah Real Monsters. Nobody has All Real Monsters. But anyways, so if you need like old school cartoon t-shirts from us 90s kids, um, Five Below Store has them. But yes, so a remote control monster tuck, five bucks. So I also got my son some bath bombs. These were also $5 from the Five Below Store. My son loves taking baths and he's constantly stealing my daughter and I's bath bombs. So I figured I'm gonna get him his very own. These are the almond and honey bath bombs. They smell amazing. You can smell them right through the bag. Oh, they smell so good. They smell like almond and honey. Really good. Um, These bath bombs do not fizz up as much as like the the handmade ones you can get from, I don't know, like Lush bath bombs. They don't fizz up nearly as much. These are definitely a generic bath bomb, but um, they are great for younger kids. Bath bombs, $5, and it comes with 10 of them. That's a pretty good deal, I think. And also, I feel like everything is from the Five Below store. <laughs> so the next thing I got my son from the Five Below store, I believe this was only $3, was the PJ Mask coloring book marker set. My son also loves PJ Masks. He's three. It's perfect and um, it has pop out in play. So you can like pop out the little characters. You can color them and then pop them out to play with them. Um, my son loves to color. He's very artistic. Both of my kids are. So this was a really good deal for only $3. I also got him. These are Christmas themed. I already gave them to him because he really needed a pair. But um, very cute for Christmas. I actually did get these from TJ Maxx. So I got him some slippers. Um, if you are following me, you know that my theme is buffalo check, red and black buffalo check. So these are perfect little slippers for him. They say, are they on the right? They're on the right size. Okay, they say little bear on them. They're very warm and cushy memory foam. I think I got these for $8.99 at TJ Maxx. This is the only thing I got at TJ Maxx besides some Ray Dunn stuff. And obviously that's not for the kids, that's for mama. Um, they are true to size, so I had the whole family set. So, but I just got him some because we already have slippers, but $8.99 TJ Maxx. And the last item that I got him that is not a stocking stuffer is, of course, pajamas. Um, every year I get our family Christmas pajamas and we always match or coordinate. And so these are just the Buffalo Check basic pajamas, the button up top with the matching um, bottoms. They're like that cotton flannel um, stuff. These are from Old Navy. They have them all right now. They have stuff for mom, dad, sister, brother, everybody the whole family can be looking real fly christmas morning in your living room okay um so i got him some some christmas pajamas and i like to put these with one toy um a little cocoa pod and a mug i will get both of the kids um a new coffee mug or cocoa mug and i put them in our little christmas eve sacks and they get to open that christmas eve and then we all watch a christmas movie in our jammies with our cocoa so christmas jammies at old navy they have so many cute designs and selections so i'm very excited um, that i got these this year now on to the stocking stuffers for my three-year-old i like to get my kids a ton of stocking stuffers i just don't like to overfill their stocking because it's just a bunch of little stuff and I don't like the little stuff. It irritates me. Um, anything that has little pieces and stuff like that. I don't like it. And they get so much of that stuff from their grandma's house or their great grandma's house that I don't like to overfill their stockings with that kind of stuff. So they get very basic stocking stuffers. So of course I got him some Starburst because he just loves candy and I got his sister one. And so I had to get him the matching one because they will fight over candy. 
I got him a Ryan's toy review. If you are a parent and your kids watch YouTube, I know you know who this kid is. Um, I got him the Ryan's Splatty Pals. It's like a squishy, splatty, slimy ball thing. Um, he loves Ryan's toy review and he's always asking about the surprise eggs and stuff like that. So I got him that. And then I got him a Paw Patrol Wonder Ball. It is just a chocolate ball with a surprise inside and that's what he's getting. So that is it for my son. Now we're going to move on to my daughter. And like I said, I already got them that game together. So she has that. And I will say up front that my daughter does have a few more things than my son and her gifts are a little more expensive because she's eight and my son's only three and he doesn't really understand yet when he gets to the age where he understands about <laughs> sissy having more than him or hers being bigger um will definitely adjust but um for right now she gets a little more expensive gifts because she's eight so um like i said we got him we got them that game and we got her the kindle fire she also got her very own bath bombs they are the exact same ones as her brother so that way there is no fighting <laughs> over colors smells nothing hers is a 10 pack again five dollars at the five below store um they smell really good and my kids freaking love bath bombs i don't know any kids that don't love bath bombs my nephew he is so silly he will take his mom's bath bombs and he'll dump like all 10 of them in the bathtub why do kids love bath bombs so much i mean i know i love them because they're relaxing and i leave my skin soft but man kids are obsessed with bath bombs these days and the next thing that I got my daughter, which this could end up being a stocking stuffer, is I got her, it was $3 at the Five Below So I got her a knock-knock book. Um, she's always telling jokes. She always wants to tell jokes or riddles. She'll sit there on my phone and get a bunch of different riddles and make uh, my husband and I sit down and try and guess them. And she loves jokes, especially knock-knock jokes. She's always trying to come up with new ones, but of course, in an eight-year-old's mind, you know, they never make sense. And I, now she has... Now she has a whole book of knock knock jokes. So I'm very excited for her to actually get this. I know she'll be super excited. Next, this, everything that I'm gonna show you here is all part of one big gift, which I know you're gonna guess it as soon as you see it. This is the Easy Bake Oven cookbook. So I got her a bunch of these Easy Bake Oven mixes, but they're $7 a piece. And I'm not about that life. There has to be a way to make the stuff from the stuff we already have instead of buying these ridiculous stupid mixes. I got her a bunch of these just because it's part of Christmas. Um, she got like five or six of them plus the two that already comes with her Easy Bake Oven. But I'm not going to be buying these throughout the year. But so we got the Easy Bake Oven cookbook which this is on Amazon. And it is obviously a cookbook of stuff you can make in the Easy Bake Oven. This cookbook tells you how to make things how it gives you recipes for your easy bake oven using like cake mixes from Walmart so obviously the next gift would be well, an easy bake oven <laughs> so like I said I always wanted one I never got one and my daughter has been wanting one. Oh, I didn't even is this is it upside down no it's not my daughter's been asking for one for the past couple years so I figured why not? They're way less expensive than I thought they were ever going to be. Um, $34.99. I did look at Target because Target has a 20% off text coupon right now. But they don't actually have the Easy Bake Oven in store. They have the Num Num or Nom Num Oven. Um, and it's the same price, $34.99. But then when I... <laughs> I went online to look at the reviews and it had two stars. So I was like, yep, never mind. I got her a bunch of Barbie and Ken clothes. My daughter has a ton of Barbies. She has a Barbie dream house that she plays with pretty much every day. And she always, just like most kids, I did too. I always lost my Barbies clothes and shoes, always. Um, so I got her a crap ton of Ken clothes. These are all Ken doll clothes. Like that's quite a bag. And then I got her a bunch of Barbie clothes as well. So that way she has all new ensembles for her Barbies. And then of course, just like my son and everybody else, Christmas jammies. So my son and my daughter have the exact same pair of pajamas in the size of, you know, the appropriate size, of course, um, from Old Navy. So they, they're going to match because I think it's cute. I'm sure eventually they're going to grow out of the matching pajamas thing, but I'm still going to do it to them and force them to take a bunch of pictures on Christmas morning because I'm that mom. Okay, so just like my son, 
I do not overfill stockings. Now my husband is a different story. His stocking is going to be so full this Christmas because guess what I did last Christmas? Guess what I did? He got nothing in his stocking. <laughs> he got Christmas gifts, but I forgot to get him stocking stuffers. Um, <laughs> I felt bad. To this day, he tells the story of coming downstairs Christmas morning and his stocking was just waving in the wind and it was just empty while we all had plush full stockings. It's quite a funny story. Um, the way he tells it is hysterical, but it was empty. So this year it's going to be very, very full um, to make up for it. I buy Christmas gifts for like 22 people and my husband only has to buy gifts for me. So no wonder I forgot, okay? Anyways, so stockings are never that full in our house because they don't need a bunch of little tiny crap, you know what I mean? They get, they get a bunch of candy from everywhere else and I'm not gonna overfill their stockings. So, Starburst, of course. Just a little bit of candy. Um, I got her a Turby Twist or here from the Five Below store, it was three bucks. They call it a twirly towel. We love these things. We both have really thick hair and this really cuts down on the dry time. Um, I'm, I should have got myself a new one, actually, now that I think about it, because mine's pretty raggedy. But, so I got, anyways, I got her a new Turby Twist. Um, or twirly, twirly towel. <laughs> and it's going to go in her stocking. She's going to be excited. Hers has a hole in She has one that has a hole in it, so. I also got her this little, this was like two bucks from the Five Below store. It is just a little travel brush. Her cousin had one very similar to this with the mirror and the, you know, the pop-out brush and its little travel thing. She had one and my daughter's been asking for one ever since and I couldn't find them. Oddly enough, I couldn't find them anywhere. And then I just happened to see him um, randomly at the Five Below store. And I thought it was really cute. It had that really cute sparkly cheetah. And you know, we're all about the cheetah print this in this life right now. And she, the last thing she got was some little candies. I don't even know what this guy is called. It's like the, the Facebook cats. You know what I mean? Um, a pushing, pushing. Is that what his name is? Anyways, this little thing opens and there's a bunch of candy inside of here. So that's what she's getting. And so that is it, guys. That is everything that I got for my son. If you have any questions, please leave me some comments down below. And if you have any video ideas um, that are holiday themed, also leave me a comment down below and I will try and get some things filmed for you guys. Um, but that's it. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, please give me a thumbs up and subscribe if you haven't already. I make one to two videos a week on family, lifestyle, cleaning and home decor and fashion and shopping all the things i i do it all okay um and follow me on instagram at coffee crafts and life i post there pretty much every single day and i'm always in stories so you can see my face a little more often you know what i mean i'll see you guys in my next video bye well i'm all for christmas all the